is up guys stealth master here with another minecraft video and whoa what the fuck that is random um anywho i have not been on mutt's world for about a week now and uh yeah i just spawned right here and look to my left okay and just random shit is going on so yeah i haven't checked up on my house lately and uh what the fuck Oh, fuck me. <laughs> Alright. Apparently, somebody stole all my crops. And that's not good. And basically, I share this house with my brother. So, yeah. We need all those crops to live. And... Holy fuck. Somebody stole my tree. Okay, so it looks like we got some griefers. Alright, so they stole my crops. My wheat and my one tree. But they didn't steal any sugar cane. I'm still building this uh, part of the garden a random two mushrooms and this used to be the farm and basically what happened was um there was like a glitch with the much world server and all like animals all uh pretty much everything like living except for like uh your person like the humans like all like zombies everything like all mobs got deleted so that means like all your animals, like all your farm animals and all like zombies and stuff got deleted. And it was like down for like two days. And basically when it came back, all like the zombies and stuff came back. But all my chickens and all my, uh, I had chickens and cows in there and they all got removed. So I was really pissed off about that. And, um, yeah, basically this is just, um, I guess an update to Minecraft. That I just wanted to like check out my server with you guys. But, um, also I wanted to show you guys how to make, like, a cool tree farm. Um, basically what I did was I took some stone slabs, and you want to make a 5x5, five five, I believe it is. 1, 2, 3, 4, yeah. 5x5 five five with stone slabs, and then make a 3x3 three three with just, um, some cobblestone. And then put one dirt block in the middle. And then you want to put, um, four torches on each of the cobblestone corners. And you want to plant a tree. And the reason why you want to put torches is because once the tree starts to grow and it gets like leaves, then, well, excuse me, um, the sunlight has to hit the bark for it to grow. And basically, the leaves are blocking out the sunlight. So you keep the torches here, and the torches will give the um, wood sunlight, and then it will continue to grow. So, um, yeah, that's uh, kind of a simple way I found out how to make a tree farm. I only have four trees. Uh, I really don't need that. I mean... As you can see, I really didn't even finish my house yet, so I might need more trees. But I didn't want a really big tree farm. I just wanted a little bit, so like a little wood here and there, and maybe like make some weapons. Even though I usually like make iron weapons now and stuff, because I have, I think I have like over a hundred iron. Let me go check that out. And I'm gonna have to plant some more uh, seeds and stuff. Oh, and something cool I found out is um, hold on, yeah, that's it. If you click shift. You bend over. <laughs> now, I know I've been playing Minecraft for about almost two years now, and I did not know that. The only reason I found that out is because, like, when I was mining for, like, diamond and stuff, like, I found diamond, but then I kept falling in lava. And, uh, the owner of this town, the mayor of the town, told me, like, when I'm, like, mining, go over one brick, click shift, and then I'll, like, stay on that brick and I won't fall. And basically, he also said, if you, you have to do that when, uh, like this is my first like uh planting I ever did because I used to play on private servers like on my own servers and you never had to like make food to eat um basically just eat food to heal yourself because my server like I never updated Minecraft and so yeah this is my first time making like a farm and stuff like that and I just learned that when uh when planting the crops you have to like bend over so you don't crush them but anywho let's uh check out how much iron I have uh. I have three rows of 64, I mean, three boxes of 64, and then one of 39. So that comes out to, uh, let me do this math real quick. Let's do 64 plus 64 plus 64 plus 39. That comes out to 231. So I have 231, um, iron iron ig ignut ig gut that's his in gut <laughs> but okay that's how i would pronounce it it's ignut ig yeah i can't even pronounce it 
right, let's just go with uh, 231 iron bars. And uh, yeah, I really want to see what the hell that is. Oh, I'm gonna die. No, I'm not gonna die. Well, I lost a heart. I'm just really confused because over here used to be a no. There's the houses, but I I believe there was a house over here before. That looks kind of weird. It looks like the guy has two belts on. But okay. Yeah, I'm really confused. Like somebody built this in what a week that I wasn't on. Wow. Let's see what this says. Created by Quimax. This is high. Love to. Okay. Looks like somebody has no life. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. I mean, ah, uh, I guess I could have finished that in about a day. I mean, I'm not really that big of a builder on Minecraft. What does this say? Uh, it's his land. Alright, so it's his land, and uh, I guess that's what he wanted to build. Oh, and that's his house. Alright, that explains it. Because I knew that there was a house over here. I thought he'd like delete his whole house. But yeah, this is his house right here. And yeah, we got like, um, new thing. There's a railroad, railroad track connecting our whole town together. So yeah, that's good. What the f Yo, you blocking the house off? Alright, apparently he doesn't want anybody in his house. And there's some mushrooms growing in there. Growing in there. I don't want to break that because I re really don't feel like rebuilding and shit. Because that's just how lazy I am. So, yeah. Some randomness. It was, This was pretty much just an update video. Um, showed you guys how to make a tree farm. Uh, just real quick. I mean, it's not really hard. Um, but, yeah. For the future, I'm going to be making some more how-to videos. And I'm also going to start some uh, Let's Plays with you guys. So, yeah, I'm gonna, like, make my own... I don't know if I'm gonna be doing Let's Plays on a multiplayer server or on uh, my own server. But I'll figure that out. I'll make my decision on that in the future. Maybe by next week I'll update you guys uh, next Monday. And I'll tell you guys whether or not I'm gonna be doing uh, Let's Plays with other people. Like, I may do it with um, my brother and some friends. Or I may even do it with you guys, my subscribers. But if not, I'll just do it by myself, and I'll start off like, um, like pretty much just like I'm a newbie to, uh, Minecraft, and I'll start off making wooden weapons and stuff, and I'll show you guys how to, like, advance and, like, build houses and stuff like that, and so, yeah, that's pretty much my plan for the future, and, um, thank you guys for watching, I'm sorry I didn't have much for you this video, at least I showed you how to make one thing, a tree farm, I mean, that can come in handy to make books and stuff, and, oh, wait, there is one more thing I wanted to show you. I don't know if it's still working. Oh, shoot. My friend came on and said that all the redstone on the server went down, but that was like two weeks ago. And, so yeah, I haven't really been on. So let's go check that out. Basically, what I did was, um, I made an enchantment room. And, it's right here. And... Um, okay. Looks like somebody removed our lever. Well, there was supposed to be... Oh. Oopsie. I'm so retarded. I forgot it was two blocks back. Shows you how long I've been on. But anywho, uh, you fill this whole room with bookcases and stuff. Like, the more bookcases, the easier to enchant. You basically just go in here, and you'd put, like, uh, any item you want. And basically, that's why you build up your XP, like... Now I can update this, like, upgrade this to level 26, like, have a level 26 pickaxe. And the highest level you can get up to is 50. And basically, if you get up to 50, then, um, and you enchant, like, uh, I, I think it's a diamond, yeah, it's a diamond pickaxe. Then, uh, basically what happens is, uh, oh, fuck. It becomes, like, magical or something. It's a fortune pickaxe, they call it. So basically, you can go up to, like, diamond. And if you hit it, you'd, like, with, if you hit it with, like, a regular iron pickaxe, you'd only get one diamond out of it. If you hit it with an diamond diamond pickaxe, uh, then you get, like, I, it, it, like, uh, varies. Like, some people get, like, 20 diamonds out of one block, and it's just really cool. I find it to be really cool, so I've been leveling up to level 50, like, trying to get there. Oh, and, uh, on my next video, I forgot, I'm gonna show you guys how to make, um, 
a spawner farm pretty much like an XP farm basically I didn't make it my friend found a, a spider spawner and he just made an XP uh, farm out of it basically you just stand at one end and the spiders just keep coming and you just keep killing them I know spiders aren't the don't give out the most XP but still it's it's still uh, good to it, it got my level up to 26 and it, I didn't even like I spent like probably an hour to get up to 26 so can't call me no life and it still worked out good so yeah that's gonna be my next video for you guys so um thank you guys for watching this video don't forget to subscribe rate and comment and until next time guys peace out